Okay. I don't think it was. Now it's recording. Anyways, now I can hear it. Definitely two of the strongest players in the region, right? Yeah, Sky Raisin versus Surfspot. Yep. The classic. Best Machamp NA, for sure. Versus Best Gengar NA, for sure. Okay, Best Gengar NA, maybe, yes. He's, for sure. A lot of people would agree with me on that. He's not even we were talking about the match. All right. All right. Gengar sitting down that charged uh, shadow ball, zoning out with Champ. Champ using that side home and getting in there. This is probably the most, one of the most volatile matchups for Gengar. It's the, the most powerful power character in the game against a 5'10". Like, I mean, it's so volatile. Every matchup versus Machamp is volatile. All that Machamp needs to do is just get in there. At least with other characters, they have more health. They have more health to spare than Gengar. Gengar is doing a great job zoning out with that charged Shadow Ball, but Champ getting Chase in there with that charged CA. All right. He tries to get the submission, but he's able to punish it with the spell. Yeah, Shadow Punch. Counter. Getting away from him, just in case he was going to try something. Try mid high. With his side moment, running right into that home uh, shadow punch. Ooh. I don't know if air grab would have worked there. All right, Gengar sending the space down with that charged shadow ball, shadow punches. Astonish, uh, getting them out. Dun 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 dun. <laughs> Astonish like is John. virtually unpunishable. It is very unpunishable because he does go straight into iframes during that. Nice uh, duck there. Nice her spud to punish. It's not, it's not quite un unpunishable, but like you still have to commit after it. It's just at that point you have to make everything it. after it is punishable. It in itself is punishable. Nice use of the shadow ball to cover himself. All right, getting in there. All right, going for that. That's kind of, that's punishable. Yep. Yes. As far as I know. All right. Gengar setting it down. Side Y punishing that omen of the CA. Okay. Getting that close pressure. Charge X. Okay. Oh, the Tracer curse doing point. big damage. Getting big meter. Gengar. I love how like when it's not comboed, because none of the hits combo each other. Even if it does, like only when it combos, it shows all the damage. Because it does around around the same damage as before. Right. The champ shield is looking crispy. It gets Whoa. broken. Yep, that's a free punish. I think. Actually, I don't know. Gosh, this is so hard. Yeah. Getting chained into that tick grab. You know, for a guy that says he doesn't like hypnosis, he uses hypnosis. I'm a guy that hates You dig like every five seconds. Yeah. If it works, it works. Yeah, it's true. Oh, don't even say it. Shut up. <laughs> You're just saying that to be part of the conversation. Sky Raisin says he doesn't like submission when we all, when the diet lie detector determined that was a lie. Okay. It's true, that's a lie. <laughs> it is a lie. Game two. No changes whatsoever. All right. Actually, Gengar calling Frog Deer right off the bat. He had that whimsical cheer support action going on. Ooh, nice grab there by, by Sky Raisin. Oh my gosh. Great read. We have too many players in this in Nebraska that start have their name start with an S. Oh, that submission would have worked too. All right, Gengar working his way out of the corner there, they getting get body right slammed down. Here. Low stances the yeah. CA and punishes it with grab. Yep. Oh, most characters can do that too. We just opt the count. We just opt the shield. At this. All right. Oh, it just freaks. <laughs> That was, that was a nice, that was a nice uh, mix up there. Buy some fun. Gotta always look out for those tick grabs. Yeah, they're nasty. All right, jump X hitting on the counter in vulnerable frames. All right, Gengar getting in there. Just trying to cancel out that shadow ball. Sending oh, out those sludge bombs, putting down the attack debuff on Macham. Macham's yeah. sitting in rage. He's not quite towards burst, but he does have TV going. We learned to not be too concerned about the attack buff because it's only like I think it's an eight-second debuff per, and it doesn't stack. So I think it just each sludge bomb you hit resets the time. Time sticking. Oh, One yeah. second. Yeah, he's not getting that. Time out. Uh, 
I just saw her. She's no longer in the poker bracket though, so. Yeah. All right. Gengar going straight in with that Shadow Ball, Shadow Punch. Champ not having any of that Shadow Sneak, grabbing straight into it. Yep. Oh, nice submission there by uh, Skyrim. Armor him right through that uh, Astonish. Okay, Gengar, Shadow Sneaking through that sh Shadow uh, Oh. Shadow sneak. Okay. I like how he used submission to just not get... To just keep himself safe and not get pushed back, but unfortunately he still gets grabbed for it. Alright, that mock punch will hit. Uh, this time that homing attack. That usually works, but... Both players pop and burst, the champ right. Oh, wiggle slip! <laughs> the reeds! Oh, he goes, when he goes back, that, he like he like revs back a little when he does charge X. When he All does right, uh, the mix yeah, up. Five X. Machamp sitting on 4 HP attack Woo. buff. He's got rage. Oh, and he counters. Just ran out of burst. Counter. Oh, he gets a counter. No coaching. Go well, Lucario. Hey, um, Sky Reason. There's this cool character called uh, Lucario. Man, don't tell me Carrie. Implying that Sir Spud doesn't already know how to play Lucario. Now he works. Ba -ba 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 yeah. All right, all right. Let's get into it. Machamp starting off that round with the flex. Gengar sitting down with the space. Side Y. Astonish. Oh, that, I, such a weird range. And Champ getting in there with that cross chop, busting through those projectiles. He's got the corner pressure. He rolls in for that normal grab. Big damage. Two or, one or two more good uh, reads from Skyrim. That's it. Mock Punch catching Gengar jumping up in the air. His HP is sitting at a crispy 118 after that oh. Eevee call. But Gengar getting the... I think he was uh, thinking about grabbing too. Yeah, guard break. One more good punish from, from Skyrim and that's going to be it. All right. Champ getting that Eevee. Gengar's working in that meter. He's working on it. Oh my god. Almost armored through that That's shadow. So punch much submission. so much synergy you get from curse. Nice punish there. Bye Skyrim. You ticked him for the mix up, but no real conversion out of it. Gingar backed out right away. That gives him burst too. Whew. Here we go. Half the rest of the match he's making Gengar. Ten seconds on the clock. The champ feeling the pressure here. Yep. Gengar getting guard broken. <laughs> He's gonna, yeah. He, he has to get in here. Yeah, he's not gonna do it. Oh, oh and he wins too, so he gets his, he gets his supports. For this round. Because when you win a timeout, you don't get your supports back. You don't, you don't get your tier skill back. He's got that special tier going on, so he's got uh, Eevee for a reason. No, he's got, he's, he's, he's using Whimsical. Oh, Whimsical? Yeah. Okay. Jeez. That looks like so much damage with Gengar. Nice punish All there. Right. Two wags. Two X eggs. <laughs> Gengar homing straight under that cross shot. Alright, alright. Calling in the Eevee for the damage. Woo! Wake up slap! Wake up slap. Yeah. Why? Not working out. Gengar's got the hard knockdown. He sets out a charge shadow ball and some sludge bombs to try and control this space here. Unfortunately, he does lose his burst. So he's just and gonna have to wear a tacky buff. Playing that oh, bomb. that hits. Gengar feeling the corner pressure right Ooh, now. Trying to wake that. up the hypnosis out. That'll do it. Good conversion from uh, Sky Raising. Yeah, yet, but Sir Spud is at match point, so. This could be it. It's anyone's game. Yeah, definitely. Nice patience there. Bye, Sky Raising. I'm gonna lose this. Going with a jump back shadow sneak JX oh. for that shield break there. Cham still holding that charge. And let's so loose on it. Oh, goes under that forward wide. 
Doesn't even look like something you can go under, too. Karate chop to cancel out that projectile. Huh! Oh, hits him on the grab frames. And we just gotta wait this out. With good damage, lots of meter. Not that it matters, but uh, Sir Spud's sitting on full meter right now. Yeah. Oh, it tries to hit the ball on the frame. Unfortunately, it doesn't work. It's the grab. Going straight into that phase with the grab. So now for the rest of the match, Gengar can be Mega Gengar. Once he bursts, it's not going away. And Champ is right now fighting a very uphill battle. He may have Rage, he may have Attack Buff, but he does not have not out, yeah. Synergy, and he just now oh worked his way out God. of the corner. Yep. You gotta just work off anything that your opponent does. Oh, and that's it, yep. Alright, so your spud takes us 3-0. Very close on each round, on each round, though. It never got, like, it was always down to the wire. 